Hey guys, welcome back. This is a, another retro let's play with Neo Brian. Uh, today we're going to be playing Karatika. I saw this the other day on uh, an Apple forum. Uh, somebody posted it up and I had forgotten. This was one of my favorite games. So the backstory here, high atop a craggy cliff guarded by an army of fierce warriors stands the fortress of the evil warlord Akuma. Deep in the darkest dungeon of the castle, Akuma gloats over his lovely captive, the princess Mariko. Oh, we must save the princess. You are one trained in the way of karate, a karateka. Alone and unarmed, you must defeat Akuma and rec rec rescue the beautiful Mariko. Put fear and self-concern behind you, focus your will on your objective, accepting death as a possibility. This is the way of karateka. All right. Here we're getting the story. Bad dude points. He's got an eagle. I don't know if this is a political message against powers that have eagles as their things, as their mascot. Oh, the door shut. Poor Mariko. Mariko's got a booty on her. There's a bench right there. Why you fall on the floor? Ooh, that looks like it has a head on it. Buildings shouldn't have heads on them. That's awkward. There I am for real now. I have climbed the craggy cliff. Got that wonderful APM music. No, no, no. Don't do that yet. Let's stand up. Let's. Now the bad thing about this game, if you get punched while running, you will die. Actually, in a standing position. I have no idea why, but if you're standing and get hit, game over. I think we'll bow to this guy. He's just guarding the gate. He doesn't know that we're after anything yet, right? Let's just give him a bow. Aw, he bowed back. Isn't that nice? Let's bow again. You can't bow too often, right? And he bows again. Nice guy. Well, look at us bowing. All right. Dude, I'm not really bowing. I'm just stretching out a little bit before I'm kicking your tail. He looks like a moose man. All right, let's fight. Oh, and he's ready. Kick to the face. Kick to the belt. Yeah, there's only a few things you can really do. Um, the mechanics of the game, you can do three kicks in a row. And you'll see as we play, if they're in the process of kicking, you'll miss. The mid-level kicks seem to work really well. I use them a lot. Um, ooh, nice combo there. Kicking a knee. Uh, you got to move in real close to use the punches, but the nice thing is you can do more than three punches at once. So there's your Karateka strategy. There's not too much to it. And I'm running because I want to go save the princess. Bad dude! Bad dude points. It's always bad if a bad dude points. Me running. Other guy running. Me running. It's nice because you're supposed to cover some ground here. Moose man running. Now remember, oh, oh, got to get in fighting stance before he hits you or you die. One shot when you're not in fighting stance and you die. Just like in real life. Kick, kick. I like the kicks. Keep missing with the kicks. Ooh, moved in. Mistake on your part. Oh, bye bye A quick bow to the fallen warrior. Oh, and that killed some of my time. I should have been running. That's okay. Whoa, and he, the body disappeared. Hello. Get in my stance. There you go. Good. Oh, he knocked me back two steps with one punch. That must have been like the Bruce Lee six-inch punch. I hit you, blue man. When uh, Back in the early 80s when I played this game, it was always on a green screen. So it's kind of nice having color in this 8-bit world. One more shot. Whoa, I got cocky. No! Oh! Ah! All right, one of the negatives with keyboards. That's okay. The end. No, it's not. Attempt two! All right, let's just get down to business with this guy. Hey, G. Oh, there we go. Got a little too close for comfort there. I'd be sad to lose on the first one. Oh, we're really close. 
Two stone punches. Ah, oh, we got too far away. You know, in martial arts, it is often like this. People are outside of your range, and yet you still kick at them. It's just basically a waste of energy. Let's see, what, what is he doing? Of course, a big thing that we learn in martial arts is uh, get off the line. You know, when people come directly in and out like that, that it's just it's bad, bad form. Because most of the time, you can just step off the line, and it puts you in a more advantageous position. But unfortunately, most games are linear. You don't really have that option. Well done, worthy adversary. And I run past you. And I'm now the bad dude that points. He's a pointer. Got to be careful of pointers. Got to admit, he's got a nice costume there. A little shredder-ish if he was made of metal. And the running part. As I mentioned, actually, the running part is nice because you're covering some ground. So it's the way you advance in the game. Okay, get down, get down, get down! There you go. Whew! That was close. Aha, uh -huh, moved in on you, you did. Three kicks to the belt. Oh, and he returned a kick to the belt. As you can see down at the bottom, the orange is my life bar, the blue is his. And you do want to keep fighting because you do regain that energy. So uh, if you just leave him alone, he will eventually regain energy. Because I could actually run from here. Now, this is a bad thing because I'm losing ground. But you see now he's up two more. So it's two more hits i got to do. Although if you've got a bad strategy, you need to retreat and get yourself built up a little bit. That's not always a bad thing. Running, 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 running. Oh, that was quick. Oh my god, get down. Thank you. Whew. Another close one. I gotta quit cutting those so close. I make up a lot of ground, but. Well, actually, I only make a couple of steps of ground. Wow, this guy just taking it, isn't he? Has he even hit me once? Why are you punching? You're far out. Poor guy. Flawless victory. Run, Karataka, run! I don't think they ever mentioned this guy's name. Well, that one's close, too. I don't know why I like cutting those close. And as you see, the farther you go, the smaller your energy bar is, and the higher your enemy's energy bar is, which is one of the things that makes this a tough game. Other than the eagle, I hate that eagle. Uh, that eagle was the bane of my existence as a child playing this game. I had a really hard time figuring out um, the timing. Oh, that stupid eagle. And he just flies in and flies away. Come on, come on, come on. There you go. Bow. Biff. Pam. Wait, Pam's a name. That's not a name. That's not the sound of a hit. Pam, Pam, Pam. Pam's the other one. What? Sorry, I was hitting somebody. Oh. Kick you in the face. I'll kick you in the face. Come on, I'm going to kick you in the face two more times. I called that one. And run. Run, Forest Karataka. Oh, hello. We're at the at the gate. Oh, nice step through back kick. Oh, groin shot. Look out. That's a point. Those are legal in most tournaments, by the way. That's why I do scrote hardening. I actually saw a guy on TV who, who did that. He had been training for years, getting kicked in the crotch, and they got this, uh, I think this Taekwondo guy to come up and just do a, do a shin strike right into the guy's nuts. And it was good. It was a hard hit. I mean, I don't think he hit him as hard as he could because there was danger of breaking his pelvic bone. But he hit him really hard. It, it gave him a little lift off the ground. And I don't know if that dude was playing or what, but he was like, I'm fine. I don't know. Bone hardening is a thing, but... Oh, look out! Whew! Made it in. <gasps> Scared me. Came out the last minute. I pushed past. Aw, poor Mariko. 
She got some white hair on her. There's only so much you can do with a big graphics, though, people. And honestly, this is a really great game for being an 8 big graphic. Wah, wah, wah! All right, got a three for how many? They start getting harder here. They uh, they actually start utilizing more strategy. Eventually, like I said, you can only do three kicks at a time. You'll hit some bad guys that can start doing four. I don't know if they actually do more than four, but I kick you! Oh, I got him in the nads. Nut tap, nut tap. Why keep pushing me back to the door? I'm not leaving. Not until you give me some figgy pudding. Give me some figgy pudding. Yes, it's June, and I'm making a Christmas reference. Get over it. I'm gonna move in. Kick you in the belt. Hey, at least I'm inside now. That weather outside, it was kind of chilly. How many? Rude. Well, it's his objective. Oh, and I kick you with three. I love it when they start punching and I start kicking and they're out of range. One more. Oh, no, I missed. Oh, now two more. And that's good. Now for the running. Oh, bad guy needs to point. <laughs> the bird looks. He pointed. Two by two with hands of blue. Kudos to you if you got that reference. And yes, I know they're only sending one at a time. That's okay. Some sometimes we sacrifice logic for a good quote. A good reference. There's the bird. Ah, see? I have a hard time getting the timing of that. Thanks, bird. Oh, get down, get down, get down. There you go. Kick you in the face. Kick you in the face. I'm beating this guy pretty quick. Okay. They really do get harder. I think I just had good timing on this one, and sometimes they just make bad choices. And I think that was our introduction to the eagle. I don't think we have to fight him again until we get... Nope, I was wrong. He's coming. Uh, nope. No, he's not. Ah, nut, nut tap. Come on, give me another one. Oh, moved in too, too soon. Come on, blue man. Oh, I moved in too soon. There you go. Yeah, this guy's getting four kicks now. Come on, come on. Quit pushing me. I'm going to hit you. Ah! Yeah, see that? Four kicks. Ah, we traded a hit. Oh, quit pushing me around. I don't like being pushed. Back off, man! Nope. Oh. Ah, I gotta get the timing of that. I think I feel hit twice and then I move. Yep. It's a beautiful thing about games. They have logic. Reality never works that way. As soon as you guess on somebody what they're gonna... Ah, no tap! Those should be worth two, I think. Two of those little air life arrows. Nobody likes getting hit in the nuts. Bad timing. This guy's doing pretty good. But I will still defeat you, because I am Karataka. Not if I only get one hit at a time, though. Thank you for four strikes. That's a real thing in martial arts, too. More combos you can do, the better. As long as you learn to adapt. That's the problem. A lot of times people have like planned attacks. They're like, I'm gonna do these three things, and then they get messed up on the first one and they just get lost. Ooh, nut tap! That just builds my morale. Nut tap! Got another one! Another one! Look at this! This guy's taking him. Uh, oh, got in there! Yay! Oh! Shot to the face. Take me a while to get this, this guy, isn't it? Yeah, one guy a minute ago was so easy. No flawless victory on this one. Oh, I'm button mashing. Come on. I should do something more than just a sidekick.
I don't want him to hit me in the nuts, though. Whoop! Kick to the face! Kick to the face! Ow, my knee! Eh, that didn't work. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, I got in. Put you in the face. Put you in the face. All right, kick you in the belt. <laughs> All right, so I changed my strategy up. Got a few hits in. That's nice. There's the bird, but he don't make it. Oops. Nut tap. It is uh, oh, a few nut taps there. You're welcome, dude. You weird blue dude. I don't even know why they're blue. Matches our life bar, though. Ooh. Games were pretty simple back in the day. This nice linear building. All one. Just shotgun path. See, that's what I need. You just need a nice shotgun or rifle. It's like a sniper rifle. Ever they all line up real pretty for me. Of course, my hit the princess too. She's probably along in the line too. Oh, sorry, princess. Hey, I beat all the bad guys though. All right, wearing them down. I think I'm getting close to the gate too. Forget how many. Uh... Oh, got me with the fourth kick. Forget how many. Um, I guess levels there are. We have the outside, we have the inside, then you have the other side of the gate. I think that's about it, and then the boss. I didn't beat this game often. Oh, too late. Hey, thanks for coming in. That's one of the things. They, they quit coming in after a while. Nice. Good timing on my part. Let's kick feet. Kick feet. Yes. Let's kick each other in the feet. Ah, timing's off. Come on. Feet kick! Go, go, go. Yeah, feet kick. We got one. It's the little things. Aww. Who nut tap! I swear those things should be worth two life. I mean, you got two nuts, right? Assuming your boy, well, that's thing. Maybe they're not. Maybe they're not male. That's kind of a sexist assumption. I mean, they're completely covered. These could be females. Oh, we got another foot kick. Not that it means anything. It makes me happy. <laughs> oh, he moved in. Look out! Look out! Sorry, I was looking at you guys instead of the game. Ow, my knee! Wish I could change po change fighting stances. That left knee's got to be killing me. And my face. Ha ha! Possible nut tap. Because, you know, might be female. Though it would be unusual, bad guys are not normally females. Almost! He's not even the big bad guy. How did he get five life back? Didn't I just happen to one? That may be why this thing's taking a while. <laughs> He's at seven life. It's the fight that never ends. Eight. Good grief. Thought I had a good strategy here. Come to me. Come to butthead. Uh, back down to five. Four. Three. Two. 
Oh, we're almost there. Ha ha! Victory! Alright, run. Run! The less of these fights, the better. Hello, hello, get down. There you go. Not much life on me in this game. I think the secret here is I need to hit him without him hitting me. Like that. I need to do more of that. No, less of that. There you go. Two for one, I'll take that. Nice. Alright, we're almost down to even life. I think he's got one or two more than me. Looks pretty close now. Nutshot. I can see the gate! Oh, that was nice. Two more! One more! Yay! Um, seems like this one's tricky. Maybe we gotta wait for it to go down. Because if I remember right, this thing falls on me. Yeah, I like that. <laughs> oh, look, my blood is flowing out. Uh, yeah. Alright. We failed to rescue the princess, uh, which I'm okay with. This is a great game. I absolutely love Karatika. Uh, I got excited. It's, it's amazing the number of things I forget about. Uh, and this is a game that I used to play for hours on end. And honestly, I didn't win it very many times. It's, it's a very challenging game that gets more difficult as you go. Uh, offhand, I don't remember the secret for getting through the gate. Uh, seems like you're supposed to, I don't know, maybe I'm supposed to kick or something to make it fall and then run through when it's going back up. But uh, Copyright 1984 uh, is when this game came out, so we're certainly very retro. But uh, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed that uh, view of Karatika. I know I just had a good time playing it and uh, brought back a lot of memories from whenever I was a young geeky gamer kid so all right well thank you guys for being here uh i want you to know i think you're amazing and i'm glad that you're here and i'm glad you're a part of this community and what's going on and i look forward to seeing you next time